Hey guys, Toxic Flames here, uh, bringing you another tutorial. Um, just want to say, first thing, thanks so much for all the feedback I've got. You know, there's been so many comments uh, saying, you know, thank you and all that. Uh, the first video's got just under a thousand views, which is really good. And uh, again, I'm just really grateful for that, so thanks very much. Um, if you're wondering, I am doing a perfect weapon tutorial, but that's not going to be until maybe this week or next weekend. Um, as you can see from the title, this is a video about, you know, um, what fingering you need to do for uh, the song Saviour. Maybe I wasn't clear in the last video about which fingers you need to use and when and all that, so this video is just about that. Um, I'm not going to be teaching you or any of the notes because you already know that from the last video. I'm just going to be going through the fingers. So, the first position <clears throat> is you get your fourth finger on the seventh fret of the A string, and it's in E flat again, by the way. Okay, and then at the same time, you want your first finger on the fourth fret of the D string. So you know it's it's a bit of a stretch, and then you play the the riff, and then you and then after that you move you you take your fourth finger off the seventh fret, and then you put your second finger you you keep the first finger where it is. So you put your fourth finger off, and then you put your second finger on the fifth fret of the A string. So you play the first piece, put your fourth finger on, and then you take it off, and then put your second finger on the fifth fret of the A string, and then do the. Now, uh, what I like to do, I like to put all three fingers on, and then, so when you do this, you can just take it off and you don't have to bother about putting that on, you know, you can just, it's, it's already there, but if, if you want to not have it on and then put it on, it's up to you. So remember, fourth finger, seventh fret of the A string, and then first finger, fourth fret of the D string, then when the next finger in, take your fourth finger off, and then put your second finger on the fifth fret of the A string together. Okay, so, so far we've got that. This bit. So I made a bit of a mistake there. You put your um, first finger, well, I like to use my first finger, on the third fret of the A string, okay? And then you put your third finger, you could use second, but I find it easier to do the third. And then, so on the, sorry, third finger on the fourth fret of the D string. So you've got your first finger on the third fret of the A string. Third finger on the fourth fret of the D string, and then you play the riff. Okay, so so far we've got. And then for this bit, you you, you move again. You know you, you move all your fingers. So you put your second finger on the fifth fret of the A string, and then you put your first finger on the fourth fret of the D string. So, so it's gone from first finger, third fret A string, and third finger, fourth fret D, to second finger, fifth fret A string, and first finger, fourth fret D string, and then you just play the A, G, D, G. So, I'll, I'll, I'll play a bit slowly if you want so you can watch my fingers. If you you know um you don't if you weren't sure about the fingering, um I had a comment from a person saying he might do it in the school talent show. If he does, I wish you the best of luck in that. And um, again, a uh, perfect weapon will be coming uh, this week definitely. So uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and maybe comment. And I'll see you next time. Bye.